I'm headed on a little uh, solo trip for the next two nights and just taking a really long time to get ready. to drive the van. I've never driven the van yet. So it has been over a month since we put the swivel seats in and this is the first time Katie is driving the van. <laughs> so we're gonna give her some pointers as we go and yeah she's probably gonna be great so I don't even have to worry about it. <laughs> okay. Can you touch the pedal? Oh yeah I got lots of space now. I couldn't even touch the pedals before. Um, so taking turns wide, I always checking blind spots. Luckily we have these big windows in the back. Hey darling, can I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Are we going on an adventure? Hey, darling, yeah. Boop. We could get out of town. The beautiful world around, wanna see it now. Well, we made it. The view is pretty good. Hopefully, I can get out. <laughs> Here's the view. Not a bad place for dinner. It's 9.30 since I've been wanting to go to bed since eight o'clock. I think it lasted pretty long. I found a bar of service, so I was able to text Matt, let him know that I got here. I'll catch you guys in the morning. We're up. Call this camp here. Don't really know what's going on there. It's kind of a really, really, really messy one. <laughs> Doesn't food outside just taste so much better for some reason? Breakfast. I wanted to talk to you all just a little bit about some of the things that I'm doing or trying to help deal with the burnout that I experience being a veterinarian. I personally believe, especially in the veterinary climate that we're in right now, it's almost impossible to not experience burnout. Last year was really bad. It was a really bad year for veterinarians, so I'm not immune to that. I am experiencing burnout. Some of the things that I'm doing, multifaceted, there's no one right way, there is no right way. It's just everyone has to find their own way. Um, but things that I'm doing that I found that work. One, moving, moving my body. Two, journaling and meditation. And then eating really nourishing foods. And I also, you know, get a lot of joy from making food. And that's new for me. I hate, I still hate going to the grocery store, but I used to hate cooking and everything like that. But I like it, I like it now. Um, thanks, Mary Beth. <laughs> now that we're settled, I'm gonna look for a therapist in Salt Lake. Um, I think that's a crucial piece. And I personally think everyone should go to therapy. But obviously there's a lot of barriers there and cost and everything like that. If you have any questions, if you yourself are experiencing burnout and wanna chat, um, always happy to talk about it. It's, I don't think it's something that anyone is immune from, no matter what your job, even if you are doing what you love. So yeah, take care of yourselves. Countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday 
Okay, I think we're gonna migrate for the rest of the day. Your bed is right here. Why are you on the rock? Tired, Francis? Very tired from all this fun in the sun? This is the current state of the van. Dust, dirt, a wet dog. Are you a wet dog? <laughs> Here's the only thing about the summer. Sometimes I want to go to bed at nine and it's still light out. So I'm like, it feels too early to go to bed, but I wanna, and I'm on vacation, right? I can go to bed whenever I want to go to bed. <sighs> Good morning, we survived, right Frank? We survived. I didn't sleep very well. And I think it's just because I'm alone for sure, it's because I'm alone. Um, I can't really hear anything when the fans are on and so my brain makes up things to hear while the fans are on. And then for some reason my brain also goes through these like terrible, never gonna happen like murder situations, like if someone tried to murder me, I don't know. It's the brain, who knows. I tried to bring an extra garbage bag and Frank and I are gonna just walk around and pick up whatever little things we find. There's a lot of bullets here. Um, but anyway, no judgment. Thanks for following along, guys. Don't forget to hit the like button, click the bell so you get notified if we post new content, and don't forget to subscribe. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty. The wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday Baby, don't you understand That we only get one life I wanna make